Hey friends, Ryan out here. It is about three o'clock on, I don't know, May 20th, 2023. And I saw an ad on Facebook last night for a dude that's moving up north, I assume to like Colorado or somewhere. I uh, had a whole bunch of machines for sale. One of which was a Space Odyssey and one of which was an Electra. So I uh, messaged him and he had someone actually coming to look at the Electra this morning at about noon. So he said he'd get back to me because I was like next in line. So fortunately the dude didn't take it. So here I am, uh, didn't get out of town until about two. He finally uh, was able to message me a little after one and then I had to scramble around trying to find a damn truck. Um, unfortunately, the truck was taken, and I am in an expedition that's semi-technically a work truck, headed to San Antone, which is about, I don't know, two and a half hours from my house, to get it. You can see there, we're 119 miles, he's on the other side, so a couple hours yet. Um, and we're on the Autobahn, which is I-10, that is just like packed with cars all the time, day and night, both directions. Anyway, I'll explain the deal to you after we close it, because I don't want to count my chickens, you know, but... Space Odyssey's alright, it's a good deal, it's just beat, the Electra is a really good deal. Uh, unfortunately, he is in the process of restoring both of them, so it's gonna be kind of a pile of parts so we'll see what happens and what it looks like so get there it's 310 get there a little before five hopefully get back because it's like a three hour drive back home two and a half three hours anywho don't film and drive it's irresponsible people okay people we're back on the road here So, fun story, the dude, let's just say that there was a obnoxious odor of pot coming from this guy's house, which is fine, that's fine, I don't care about that, I just think it's funny, the dude was fucking stoned out of his mind, um, anyway, fun story, if you want to skip to the good stuff, skip ahead, it's fine. This Electra, I looked back on his posts in the particular group that I saw this listing in. Uh, about six months ago, I saw an Electra in Houston for sale uh, for $300. It came up, I saw it like three minutes after it posted, and I messaged the guy and he said it's gone. Which I'm like, oh, well, shit. Okay. So, apparently it was this dude, because his pictures from that same time uh, of his Electra were, you know, the same ones from that ad, uh, and he's in San Antonio, and it was in Houston, so that's interesting. So, I get there, you know, I can smell pot wafting out of his garage when he opens the door, <laughs> like, knock you on your butt. Um, he's got the Space Odyssey on a, a rotisserie in a million pieces. He's got Electra scattered all over his garage. I'm hoping that I got all the pieces. Um, he's got boards scattered everywhere. He's got... You know, I had to tell him, hey man, you got the lock bar or the rails or anything? I don't think I ever got the rails, but you got the lock bar. Um, so, I'm hoping I have everything. He hands me this, or he has this Electra on its side on his, like, saw horses. And there's just a giant pile of parts on top of it and a bucket of screws. And he's like, here you go. I'm like, oh my God, what the hell am I going to do with this? So, 
<clears throat> I got all that. Then he pulls out the play field, which is in three pieces, because it's three play fields. It's like a triple level, you know? Uh, then he's... He makes sure he thinks he has everything, so we'll see. And then he pulls out an extra space mission, which is the four-player head, which is the one you saw behind me. This is the Space Odyssey head right here, and the guts to the space mission is on the other side of it, behind it there. So anyway, we get all this in there. Both the Electra and this, this space mission here, and the Space Odyssey for that matter, all three of them have this water damage around the front, which it looks like water damage and mud, not termites, hopefully. So, I guess we're gonna be really rebuilding more stuff, which is fine. So, in the end, I paid $100 for the Space Mission, or Space Odyssey, whichever one's a two-player version, complete machine. Um, obviously, it needs a lot of work, and it's gonna be tough to reassemble just from whatever. Uh, but I did get an extra head, which in and of itself is pretty much worth it for all those parts. The score reels and everything. And then I got an Electra for 800 um, which the original ad I'm talking about back in the day, he had it for 300 uh, So Electra paid 800 but <clears throat> it came with a set of pinball pimp stencils, which are 200 bucks, and then it came with a CPR the acrylic overlay for the middle play field, whatever it is, so you can see through it to the bottom one, which is $200. Brand new, in the box, he just, it was still half unopened, he just opened it to see how pretty it was. Now they both need a new back glass. Um, I mean, what are you gonna do, but, so, did some work on the boards, he got some new stand-ups, he probably got $100 worth of parts in it that he already installed in the playfield. He cleaned it, so he sanded one side of the electric cabinet. So I think I got a pretty kill for deal on this. Anyway, when we get home, get it out of this car that I had to Tetris it into, we will check it out and call it good. Anyway, I'll probably be tomorrow because I still got like two and a half hours and it's 6.15, so it's going to be way too dark when I get home and I need Lunchbox's help to unload these out of the car. So we'll see how that works. All right, here we go. Okay, people. It's next morning. Um, unfortunately, I think Matahari here is going to have to go in the house and be done later, which is, I guess, neither here nor there. Put it in here because it was so dirty, but eh, it'll be all right. And then we'll put a space mission there and Electra probably on top here or something. I don't know. We gotta find a place for them just because they're all taken apart in a million pieces. If they go inside, they'll be gone. So I'll move all this around. Lunchbox car goes right there. She just went to the grocery store, so I gotta get this moved in before she gets back so she doesn't get mad at me for bringing another machine in the house. Here we go. All right, got mad at Howard again, she's never gonna notice. So this is the mess. So we got our back glasses, which are both trash, so it's all right. Um, this is the new acrylic part right here from CPR. Uh, it's obviously the Electra light board with the lamp driver still attached, all the wiring. This is the Electra, the, this one and that other play field. <laughs> Looks good. And then space mission body. They've all both got a little water damage to them. See how everything else made it here. There's the bottom play field, lockdown bars. Uh, I hope he put the rails in. I thought he said he did. There's my pimp stencils. There's 
one of the heads. That's the nicer one, I think. Electra head. Very, very faded pink. See, he started working on the body. Um, let's see what else we got. There's the the one. Looks like it was laying face down in the mud or something. Better view. Some of that. Make sure nothing's gonna fall out here. It's the coin door to Electra. Actually, I don't know that he put the rails in here. Unless he's got them in the bottom somewhere. And then here's the extra light board, which thankfully did not break the window. Hopefully everything else is okay, but that is going to fall out when I take it out of there. It look like oh no okay well let me get some of this unloaded and we'll take a better look all right got a lot to get through so get ready to be seasick he did in fact put the rails in there so that's great um here's our stencils they're a little crumpled I'll be all right i'll go upstairs and lay them on flat on a spare bed here's the head that's got some Definite issues. It smells absolutely awful. Might be able to get away with just replacing the top. I don't know. But, all right, yeah, here's Electra. Like I said, he'd got most of one side and he was working on the other. Um, there's plastics, ramps, hinges, that sort of thing. Various metal pieces scattered everywhere the box of various other metal pieces and spinners and kicker or whatever that's supposed to be so this will be a project saw the back of it, it's all messed up Still see the artwork here. You may have started to strip it. That might be why it's so light, but you can see what it's supposed to kind of look like. All right, here's the back glass. Obviously it's toast. Light board. Looks pretty good actually. Coin door. A little crunched on the front there. Hopefully we can straighten it out a little bit. Here's our extra four player guts for a head. It'd be nice to turn this into a space mission, which is the four player versus space odyssey, which is the two player since I think I have a space odyssey somewhere. But here's the extra head, which is great because all it really needs is the, the valence stuff on the front. And it's very much good to go. All right, here's the cabinet. It's got a little planking here and there yonder, but I mean, honestly, that's great. The back is a little water, water damaged. He has stripped the play field, but he did start putting LEDs in some places. Um, let me see how faded the yellow is right there. I don't know what the pink is all over it. I think that's pink from Sandy Electra, to be honest. Uh, it looks like he's touched up some of the inserts, which is fine. But it looks like there's some, I don't know if that's glue or he tried to level them. I'll have to ask him, but target's broken. And when I tipped it up, a whole bunch of stuff went on the inside. So I don't remember seeing the back of it. That's frustrating, but that's easy enough to refabricate if we absolutely have to he stuck a bunch of stuff in there so hopefully that's anyway uh here are the the head for electra 
it's it's all right. It's missing the top. It's got a whoopsie right there. Side's not too bad. Um, sorry, I got all this stuff just out of the car because it was fixing the rain. It's the bottom play field. <laughs> he got serious here and took all the inserts out. <laughs> And replace all the stand-up targets. I'm not sure they're supposed to be orange, red, or what, but we'll have to check. Um, it's weird. He didn't clean up the playfield first. I put yopsicles in there. Uh, looks intact. I did drop that out of the back of the car, so when I was loading. I don't see where it got dinged up though. Um, inside the head, we kind of saw that earlier. Playfield is completely disassembled and in two pieces, but stuck together with a wiring harness. You can see it's got a little worn off part there. We'll try and fix that up a little bit. It's not covered with something. The rest of the playfield looks pretty good. Um, here's the acrylic piece, brand new, still got the shrink wrap on it, there's Space Odyssey, um, well, I mean, you get the idea, should be a good wall hanger, a little dinged up, lockdown bars, I could not get it to close with that on there, so hopefully that's the right bar. Um, what else? I mean, this is a major project. It's a little more than I thought when I was getting it. <laughs> and I keep finding screws because he just left the screws hanging out. Um, power rectifier board. Tilt board, all that. From Electra, obviously. It's like it's in pretty good shape. I don't see anything exploded on it. Displays are really, really dirty, but I don't see any of the explosions. Electra has six for your electron units. Seven digits and then six. So your five main and the extra one. Lamp board, missing one. I mean, it looks clean. I don't see any bad damage. Soundboard, he said he recapped it which looks accurate. There's two pins on that shorted together several places. I wonder if that's supposed to be that way. Um, this looks okay. I don't think he did any work to any of this. That has got some acid damage on the bottom of it. It's not terrible, actually. It could probably, probably be fixed. Maybe. And then here's just a bunch of random parts that I don't know if they go to this game. He just said, here, take this because it's in my way. So, might be Electra, might not be. So, I mean, for the price, you can't complain, but it's. I mean, trying to get this back together without knowing where anything goes will be a challenge, but it'll be a fun one to be sure. So follow along and we'll cluster mess our way through these. Like I said, I do have another one of these somewhere, so it should be fairly easy to use reference points or whatever. But for a hundred bucks, I mean, and then basically 400 for Electro, you can't really complain too much, especially since I got an extra head out of the deal. Although he didn't tell me that he'd removed all the inserts. <laughs> that's, that's a lot. Um, but it's all good fun, right? So let me know what you think. Keep it real and we'll eventually get back to Blue Max here once we figure out how to organize the garage. All right. Thanks for watching. Later.